Let's cover Panasonic's Phase Hybrid Autofocus System. So as the name implies, it's a hybrid between contrast detection autofocus and the brand new Phase Detection Autofocus. Phase Detection adds depth information to the camera that can be used to repeatedly and reliably pull focus in autofocus mode. The S5 Mark II has 779 phase detection points on the sensor, and this allows us to get extremely accurate information in combination with the pre-existing AI contrast detection autofocus. Whether you're a gimbal operator, seated at a desk, or if you're doing any type of vlogging, the autofocus will find you and track you repeatably and reliably. Let's take a look at what this phase hybrid autofocus can do. Whether you're shooting in broad daylight, in a studio, or in a low-lit environment, there's none of that telltale DFD wobble. So the autofocus has been drastically improved. It's fast and reliable, as you can see. <laughs> if you plan on doing any type of vlogging in this type of scenario, this face hybrid autofocus system will give you excellent results. It allows you to have your face in focus no matter what the situation. You can bring it in closer, bring it further away, and it will lock focus instantly. If I want to go to the background, it will find the background, as I bring it back towards me, it focuses on me instantly. Awesome. This new improved autofocus also translates over to the photography aspect of this camera. So if you plan on shooting in burst modes, these are the kind of results you can get. As you can see, the hit rate is insane. So if you plan on shooting with this camera for action, sports or wildlife, it makes a whole lot of sense. Panasonic has long been the king of having the best tools for helping your manual focus experience. One of these tools is the linear focus option. Thanks to the menu system built into the S5 Mark II, I can assign how far I need to turn the focus ring to get repeatable and reliable focus pulls anywhere from minimum all the way through to infinity. One of my favorite tools for manual focus is focus peaking. We can set the color and intensity level, so if we are shooting something in manual focus, we can see precisely what's in focus at any moment. By using the touch screen or the menu system, we can change how the camera focuses and what we see on the LCD screen. Whether you wanna punch in in a picture-in-picture -picture mode or get a full screen display, the option's up to you. This makes it very easy to nail focus. 